Mike Strand's idol when it came to golf course architecture was the great A.W. Tillinghast. And Tillinghast believed that when you create a golf course, you do it in a way where it's visually intimidating to the golfer. But once you get out there, it's not nearly as difficult in terms of playability as you might think. Perfect example right here, the opening tee shot at Tobacco Road. You stand on this tee, the first shot of the day, and all I can say is this tee shot scares the bejesus out of you. This is a perfect example of what I'm talking about. From the tee box back there, oh my God. But once you get out here, you understand that what Strand did was give you plenty of landing area. A wide open fairway for your tee shot. Completely different than what it looks like back up there. An unbelievable opening hole design here at Tobacco Road. What's got going on down there? Uh, well, see, I had this kind of 100-yard shot, and I pushed it right, which I sometimes want to do. And uh, this is what Mike Strands has given me. Bless you, Mike Strands, wherever you are. It's just your normal sand shot, greenside bunker. I don't know, what do you think, 20 feet, 25 feet? Yeah. Where's the flag? I have no idea where the flag is. Brian, go show him the flag. Brian, go show me the flag. Right over the bush there. Right over the bush? Yep. Okay. All right. I practice these all the time, so I should be good at them. Well, I hit that about 18. <laughs> uh, it's a cornice. Now, 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 I thought that was fun. Now the fun really starts. And here's the quandary. Here's the quandary. I don't believe I can get this up to the green. I think I have to play this back <laughs> down into the bunker to have a shot. Um, I bet you might be able to come this way with it. Brian has suggested playing it sideways. Well, sideways is over here. Hmm. But the moral of the story, don't hit it here pretty much. I don't think I can hit it straight. Well, you know what? I might as well try, because the worst thing that's going to happen is it's going to hit this and go back in the bunker, right? <laughs> like I said. Self-fulfilling prophecy. Okay. Let me try this again. If God knows I had so much fun the first time. <laughs> What's amazing is I'm almost in exactly the same spot I was last time. Okay. Hey! Oh, and it checked. Beautiful. Here's your putter right here, man. Thank you, thank you. Do that again, I didn't get your camera. Those of you who want to witness Darren Bunch's death on camera, keep watching. And the good thing about this, I don't need to go to the gym today. Anybody that tells you that golf is not the greatest game doesn't know what they're talking about. We're here at Tobacco Road Golf Club at sunset on one of the most beautiful holes you'll find anywhere. And I gotta tell you, I could stay here all day. We're coming to the close of another couple of great days at Mike Strand's golf courses. Here's something I want you to think about. It shows the true value of Mike Strand's to the golfing community. In 2000, Golf Week gave Mike the honor of being one of the 10 greatest architects of all time. Golf Week. That award was based on six golf courses. An award that was so incredibly richly deserved by Mike Strands. And again, anytime you have a chance to come out to one of his layouts, jump on it.